I absolutely love hedgehogs. They're so cute. I want to kiss their fairy little faces. Unfortunately, I don't think they're going to let me. And if they did, I don't think they'd like it. However, there are other ways in which you can make hedgehogs happy. So the first thing your hedgehog is going to need in order to be happy is a cosy home to live in. I'm in my wild area where Shakti, my hedgehog, has made her home behind the shed. It's perfect. She's tucked away, safe from predators and surrounded by foliage. So you may or may not need to build a home for your hedgehog. You can buy them ready-made online or you can make one from wood. Or you may find that your hedgehogs are quite happy just nesting in places around your garden. Your hedgehog will furnish their home with foliage and dead leaves that they find around the garden. You can also help them out by providing some dust-free barley straw. Don't use hay because it does get wet and go mouldy and it can make your hedgehog very ill. Talking of dead foliage and leaves, be really careful when you're digging through your compost pile or cleaning up piles of leaves that have accumulated in your garden because hedgehogs can easily and happily fall asleep there. Another way you can make your hedgehog happy is to look out for places where they can't get around the garden easily. So I noticed on the night vision cam that my hedgehog was having real problems getting up and down these steep steps. So I invited my friend Phil over and we built her a hedgehog ramp. It took her a little while to realise it was there, but now she quite happily goes up and down the ramp with no problem whatsoever. So something that can make both you and your hedgehog happy is a night vision cam. I use a trail cam, which was a birthday present this year. Thanks, Phil. So the reason it makes me happy is I can see what she's been up to all night and watch her shenanigans. It could also help my hedgehog in the future if she gets ill. If I see her limping or in any kind of distress, I know I will have to scoop her up and call the Hedgehog Rescue Centre. So get yourself just a cheap trail cam and watch what they get up to while you're asleep. So the final way in which you can keep your hedgehog happy is to provide some food for them. Now, hedgehogs eat invertebrates, so they will eat all the slugs and the snails from your garden. But you can supplement their diet by adding in a couple of bowls around the garden of dry cat or dog food. I use these dry kitten biscuits. As long as they've got a high meat content, then that's exactly what they need. Also, make sure you leave lots of bowls of water around the garden, as they have a tendency to get very dehydrated, especially in the summer. Another advantage to feeding your hedgehogs a supplement to their diet is that they will always come back to your garden because they know where they can find food. Gotta keep the wildlife happy.